All right, so I was supposed to put out a video last Wednesday, so I do apologize for that. Um, just it, things happen, I guess, you know. Um, so the, happy 4th of July. Uh, I know it's a day early, um, but uh, once again, happy 4th of July. Um, I don't know if I'll be putting out something tomorrow. Um, probably not. Um, usually don't do the weekends and it'll be the 4th. But uh, there's a chance of it. I am definitely trying to get into more videos. Um, but this is my review for a Amazon original uh, movie, and they uh, called My Spy, starring David Bozista. Um, I've done a couple of video, a bunch of videos, uh, movies of him before. Uh, I definitely am a fan of him. And, um, you know, there's, his movies have been, you know, here and there, um, you know, they're good, but they have some issues with, a lot of issues with them. Um, he does this kind of small side budget movies, um, outside of the Guardians of the Galaxy, uh, franchise. Uh, I definitely do like him a lot. Um, I think he does a good job. There was a movie he did that was called Game. It was it was not it's not Game Night because that's a whole different movie. But he definitely did a a a um, I forgot what it's called. I'll have it in up here. But um, it definitely wasn't good. Uh, it was horrible. And you know I, I did review one. I don't know if it's one of my good reviews or not. Um, my early reviews are just like cringy or just bad quality so um i don't recognize the actress in here that plays the mother and i kind of recognize the guy who does who's the bad guy um but this movie is a comedy and um it the, the comedy was definitely a bit stale for first 30 minutes for me personally and um you know, it definitely does pick up after a while. And, um, you know, it, it's not like ha ha out loud funny, but it's definitely some kind of smiling for me, kind of funny, kind of grinning. Um, definitely they make some fun of, uh, of action tropes to it. And definitely a good amount of action to it but i seen more way more action and co action comedies than this one um but the definitely the special effects were good definitely the acting was good i i definitely love the um the chemistry between dave Lusta and this little nine-year-old uh i don't know if she's really nine i think she's like 10 or something um, but I, I definitely did. I definitely loved it. And there, uh, again, it has some uh, funny parts towards the end. And, you know, some cool shots. And uh, that was about it. Um, overall, the movie was, was a great story. Uh, comedy was uh, good for the most part. The action was definitely good when, it, when they had it. Um, I definitely would say this is a family movie and I would definitely recommend that even if you don't have kids um, That you w check this movie out. I, it, I definitely really did love it by the end um, I would highly recommend it and I give this four uh, out of five stars um, The actress in here who plays the girl with the bunny ears in um, Bob's Burgers um, I'm not too big of a fan of her because I haven't really seen in her anything much that I've liked her in, uh, but I thought she definitely did a good job later towards the move, the end of the, towards the second half of the movie, I think. You know, uh, her, her comedic style is not necessarily for me. Um, I think she does a good at voice acting as the girl with the bunny ears um, on Bob's Burgers, but outside of that, it's just not, not my type of style. I guess maybe because I haven't, really seen her in much um screen time so but yeah i mean good movie and i i i i, I, I there's not much more to say it's a great movie and it's something you should watch um leave a comment down below have you seen this movie have you heard of it uh, please like and subscribe um 
Yeah, uh, have a good day, everyone. Skull.